Hi lovies, how are you doing? I hope you're doing well. I'm very grateful yet thankful for having you guys. Thank you so much for keeping coming back to view my content. I really appreciate from the deeply part of my heart. Thank you guys for your support. Honestly, warm my heart. But if it's your first time you're watching my video, hello, how are you? Welcome, feel at home. My name is Glory Mtui. Before you leave, kindly subscribe and turn on notification bell. If you like this content, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to share with your loved one. You wish they know how to do this tutorial. In today's video, I use expression here. I use color one and I cut into two equal parts. Then I stretch my hair. This is how I stretch in case you don't know how to stretch. Slowly, slowly pull some fewer hair out till you finish your section. Before you use brush to brush your hair, pass your finger in the middle to avoid to lose too much hair when you brush with brush. And then follow it with a brush and when you're brushing, start from down to avoid losing too much hair. Because I used to brush so roughly when I just started to stretch my hair and I find every time I lose a lot of hair. So guys, brush from down to avoid losing too much hair. My hair is very fresh, I just wash. I'll be using rubber band, crochet needle, and shine and jam gel. But, but gel, you can use any kind of gel that works for your hair. But for me, this gel for braiding is the best. After section my hair, I take a little amount of gel and I apply on my hair. Then I take a rubber band and I secure the section. This is the section of hair I'll be using. I divide it into two, but I make sure one side is smaller. So the small section is the one I'll be crocheted. I roll on top to make it easy to crochet. Then I crochet. I pull the hair. Before anything, I make sure the braiding hair, they are even. Then I pull my natural hair just a little, not too much, honey. Just pull a little to make your section well. I take another section. I put on top of this hair, I crochet, then I'll start braiding. To cover elastic band, you have to pull the section with rubber band a little in then continue braiding just in a normal way i hope here you get my point then i continue braiding here i braid going down every time when i'm braiding i make sure the section have my natural hair i cover it well with those braiding then i continue braiding This style is very easy, even for beginner friendly. After I go several steps, I turn the section. When I turn, I make sure I hold mid of the section to avoid the section to unravel. Then I continue braiding, but in this time, I'm going frontwards. After I turn, I go front. If you turn in right way, after I finish braid, you'll find your braiding is straight away. But if you turn in wrong side when you finish braid your section you'll find your section bent when I want to add hair I just take a very small section like this I hold together then I continue braiding if you take small section you'll find you cannot see where you add hair you can see guys it's very hard but once you take big section it will be very easy for your hair to bend or to show where you add hair so every time when you add hair just take small section then continue braid and this is how the back section looks like guys let me show you in front so that you can see more clear the small section i roll i hold over here then i crush it put the braiding hair in my crochet needle then i pull out before anything i make sure the hair is even then i pull my hair just a little bit don't pull too much then i apply some gel to cover my natural hair 
then I take another section I put on top then I start braid as I said here I'm going downward but every time when I'm braiding I make sure I cover my natural hair because I don't want my natural hair to show out you know natural hair helps when it comes to natural hair to show out of braiding so I make sure I cover my hair every time when I'm braiding to avoid my hair to show out and that is how I go till I make sure I finish my natural hair and then I turn the braiding then I go frontwards I don't know personal I feel like when I turn and go frontward I can braid a little bit fast than going backward that's why after some times or after I braid for a while I just turn the section and I braid going front and this is how I go till end I braid the section till I almost finished the braiding hair but this is completely option you may decide to braid your section till end or half and you may see this is how the hair looks like you cannot see where I add hair you cannot see where I turn the section like everything look the same if you never braid your hair let me give a little um, secret on how to part your hair when you're parting if you want your section to be well you have to put each section you have to put in between the previous lines as I did here you can see every section I put in between the previous line and for those people who have been asking me like how do you braid your back section today I'm going to show you like how I braid so after I crochet I pull the hair in the middle don't forget to add some gel on your hair especially if your hair is natural then this is how I hold my hair yes like this with my thumbs finger help me to hold it well then I put on top and then I start braid and this is how I normal braid my back section so after this I continue braid just the same way till half of this braiding and after this I will turn then I'll continue braiding in front direction if you have any idea of hair tutorial and you wish I can make a video for it please leave your comments in comment section just tell me what kind of hair tutorial you want me to make and if that content is clickable in my channel I promise I will make it for you guys because if it's not you I will not be sitting here creating this content and I really want to give you more good hair tutorial so guys just tell me your thinking just tell me what do you think then I'll work on your ideas guys here I almost done this is my last section and if you're wondering like how many packs of expression here I use up to this point I use almost three packs and I use color one each piece I cut into two and here I'm done with braiding mm -hmm. so this it is quick I'm going to trim off all the excess hair that hanging out just to make my braids clean and neat so take your time you may decide to use scissors to trim off or you may decide to use the lighter to burn it off just do anything that works for you
Then I take hot water 100 degree and I and I put my hair in. Just be careful, honey. Don't hurt yourself. So be careful slowly, slowly. And guys, guess what? Guess what? This is the final result for today's video. Thank you so much guys for watching. I hope you enjoy watching this video and you get something. If yes, kindly subscribe. Give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to share as much as you can with your loved one. I always appreciate your support guys because without you I'll not be here recording. I love you guys so 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 much and I will see you very very soon on my next video guys. Bye bye.